Hey guys, this is a 3D printer and today we're gonna to be talking about why are woodworkers buying 3D printers and getting into the 3D printing business and why it's exploding and why you probably should consider maybe getting a 3D printer for yourself. Now, this is a Bamboo A1 Mini. It's very affordable. It's only 250 bucks and you can actually buy an additional attachment that you can actually do for color printing, which when you think about it, for about 250 bucks plus the additional printing if you want to add that, it's about $500, which is very, very cheap compared to most tools that we have in our shop. And the potential to make money is enormous. And I think that's one of the many reasons why you're seeing woodworkers buy and invest in 3D printing. There are woodworkers out there like Shop Nation who have printed things for dust collection for a miter saw, Wit Works who has a cap for track saws, and these guys are making thousands and tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of dollars a year 3D printing things for the woodworkers. Now, this is, I think, a booming industry right now that is just seeing the beginning stages of the growth that is happening because the price of these things are so affordable. You see Izzy Swan, who is now going to be getting into 3D printing. He just went and bought, I think, six or eight 3D printers, and he's going to be doing something awesome, which you know if he's a genius woodworker and maker and fabricator, and if he has an idea, he can probably make a lot of money doing that. So buying an A1 Mini is a really affordable way to enter this marketplace to test out 3D things. Now, you might be asking or saying to yourself, hey, I'm a woodworker. I know nothing about 3D modeling or printing. You know what? That's totally okay. A lot of them out there don't even know how to 3D model themselves. They hire people off Fiverr to model for them, and then they sell those models and print them in their own print farms and make lots and lots of money. So you don't have to get into this industry knowing 3D modeling if you don't want to. Now, myself, on the other hand, I know how to model in 3D. It's something that I went to college for way back in the day. So I have a little bit more advantage than most woodworkers because I can come up with my own things, prototype them very quickly. I don't have to pay someone else to model it for me and then buy those models and then resell them to you to make money. Um, which is what I'm going to be doing. I am actually going to be coming out with a whole uh, series on how you can make it with a 3D printer. If you're interested in watching that series, I'm going to be filming my first episode here soon. So be sure to hit that subscribe button to follow if you want to see that. And it's really about how can you make money as a woodworker 3D printing? Where do you start? Can I make money with a 3D printer? I'm going to answer all these questions and actually just document it. It's, it's going to be real life just raw, natural, I'm using a 3D printer for my woodworking business and to generate additional revenue. But that's one reason why these printers are so popular is that they're very affordable and this is very well made. I was actually shocked that I got this for $250. I mean, the electronics and components and all the things that are in it, uh, it just blows me away that you can actually buy something this affordable and test and play with. And that's what's so great. And I think that's one big reason why the Bamboo A1 Mini is so popular right now with woodworkers. And this industry is just booming because the potential to make money is real. It's not a joke. It's very real and you can make a lot of money. So if you're interested in getting one, I'll put a link in the description below. Um, I'm not an affiliate or anything like that. I'm just doing this to help you guys out because I want you to be successful. The other thing that's really great about these 3D printers is they're upgradable. You can upgrade your nozzles. You can get different types of nozzles. You can upgrade to four color. This is one color right now. So I invested 250 bucks and have this. Now I just recently bought a four color and bought more printing colors uh, because I want to test other things out. And I have some really awesome ideas that I think that the woodworking and making maker community will really like. And I just want to test those things and it's very affordable to do that. It's basically cheaper than buying really nice lumber, which is just shocking to me. So if you want to test this out, be sure to look into it, research it. But the A1 Mini, great buy. And that's why I think they're so popular right now. And it's very affordable to get into this. And the potential to make money is just there. 
So I hope you found this helpful, but I think the biggest reason why this is just blowing up in the woodworking industry is because a lot of people wanna make those $10,000, $100,000 a year coming up with that one great idea. Don't copy people, that's not what you need to do. Come up with your own idea, niche down, really focus on what you want and go after it because the opportunity is there, guys. I mean, you can see it right now just by many other woodworkers that you might follow on YouTube are buying these printers because they see the opportunity and you need to take advantage of the opportunity too, just like I'm trying to and see where it fits. It's a really low risk. Anyway, all right guys, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna start printing stuff and working on my episode series showing you guys how I'm gonna use a 3D printer to save my woodworking business. Till next time guys, I'll see you later.